The last task is management. This task addresses change requests. The goal is to identify, control, and track requirements and changes the requirements at the project progresses. In this part, it is also important for me to discuss the change request. Based on my experience, this is the normal process when we accept changes to be implemented in the system. First, we have raising a change request. It is good to use a template for raising a change request. Identifying a schedule when these changes can also be accommodated. Next, we have assessing change requests. We need to assess the impact of change requests to the project schedule and also to the budget. We also need to assess as well the impact if the change is not accommodated. Then, making a decision. In making a decision, we need to review the impact analysis. Then, the management will decide based on the analysis. Lastly, accommodating change. This time, once the change is approved, then this will be accommodated. Then these changes will be communicated to the developers, and of course, it should be well documented. Like class, like what I mentioned earlier, the things presented in this lesson are not a foolproof solution to the challenges in the requirements engineering, but they somehow provide a solid approach in addressing these challenges.